Hey guys, I'm Will, and I'm going to share with you an exciting and meaningful hunt I had with my nephew during the youth gun season. Before it's getting dark, the deer come into the field when they're supposed to. One does, and it's a buck fawn, of course, and I'm like, ah, we can't shoot it. Um, it's a buck fawn. We're going to hold off and see what else happens. And I can see the fawn looking back into the wood line. I know there's more deer. And so um, it's looking back, it's looking back, but no deer are coming. And I'm like, okay, well, we got a little bit of time, but light is fading. Suddenly, my wife gets in her vehicle, and we're only, you know, food plots only 150 yards from my house tops, and uh, uh, that little buck goes running off the field, and instantly I'm like, I screwed up bad. I should have just let him shoot that deer, and now we might not get a deer at all before it gets dark because I'm being stingy with my buck fawns, okay? Five minutes later, I can see him in the wood line again. I see two deer. He comes out with his bum-legged, crippled mom, the the target doe. So I've had the longest history with any deer on this property with this crippled doe. I had a few close calls with her during last bow season. I was going to kill her, but she gave me the slip a few times. And then I even have uh, video footage of her working scrapes and stuff like that. Dude. <laughs> you're, you're, you're like dead. I know. That's so loud. Look at the Put the safety on. It was really impressive that he could, he was that excited, breathing and shaking like that, that but he could control that excitement and get those crosshairs on her and put them in there on her at 80 yards, two of them, center mass, no problem. Th that, that to me was impressive. So uh, um, she went down, uh, we did a bunch of high fives and uh, he was just rattled, excited about it. But, um, and I was too, it was awesome. He must've told that story, you know, two dozen times and called everyone he knew and told them. And each time he told them, it was like even more exciting and, uh, you know, and it was, it was wild, awesome stuff. So um, I think we made a hunter and he already said he wants to come back out and try to get a buck and I want to do that too. So hopefully we'll have that video for you too. Thanks for watching.